Let's go to Deuteronomy chapter 7, verse 15. To the left is the King James Version. To the right is the Expanded Bible. And the Lord will take away from thee all sickness and will put none of the evil diseases of Egypt, which thou knowest, upon thee, but will lay them upon all them that hate thee. Yes, this is the Old Testament. Yes, this is speaking to the nation of Israel. But as you know, we have been grafted in the covenant that God made to Abraham and his seed. So to Abraham and the Jews, we are the Gentiles, the non-Jews. But we are under this agreement as well. So yes, this may be speaking to the nation of Israel, but it applies to everyone in this world. So what is it saying? This is saying, if you obey God, he is not going to put a disease on you. Let me read it again. And the Lord will take away from thee all sickness, everything, all sicknesses. Not some, not only cancer and stuff like that, everything. And will put none of the evil diseases of Egypt, which thou knowest upon thee, but will lay them upon all them that hate thee. So, you should not be sick. Even if my body tries to get sick, I say this out loud. In Jesus' name, I am healed. And I continue to say that. Like, for maybe three or four days, or three days, I believe my throat was trying to get sore or something. So I continued to say, I am healed in Jesus' name. Guess what? My throat is not sore anymore. Because back in the past, the way that things would go, first my throat would get sore, then I would get really, really sick. No, I am healed in Jesus' name. So this is a covenant promise. If you are following the rules and regulations of the Bible, you have this promise. This is a promise. If you follow me, I am going to heal you. So if you are not healed, there is a reason for it. Give me a second. So if you are not healed, if you are not healed, there is a reason for it. I'm serious. Well, Kevin, you know, I am not healed because blah, 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 blah. Excuse, excuse, excuse. No. If you are following God, obeying his rules and regulations, you should be healed. If you are not healed, don't give up. Continue to pray. Continue to do the right things. I'm serious. This is a covenant promise. So you can't really give an excuse. Okay, God bless.